going and what they're doing. Now you got that right. Uh, let's go ahead and talk about Gronk. You said he met with the media today via a Zoom call. Uh, That's right. Hey, what What was it like? I mean, we have breaking it? news. Giannini, brother Giannini, you will love this. Gronk's Zoom name was Roberto on, on, the, Gronk, <laughs> on the Gronk call. His, his Zoom name is Roberto, not Roberto Gronk, or just Roberto. He was Roberto on the Gronk, on the, uh, on the Zoom. Uh, so, yes, he was there talking to uh, the members of the media, and uh, I, I thought it was interesting. I mean, it, he, gave, he gave a lot of the answers that you would suspect. They asked, him, they asked him something very interesting, which was if Tom Brady had elected to stay in New England and play this season, do you believe you would have come out of retirement? And he said, I, I really want to play football again. And if Tom was still in New England, I may very well have, have said, yeah, let's come back and, and, and do this one more time in New England. So I know that doesn't make you feel any better, Brother Giannini, to hear that, but he no, was no, giving some honesty fine. about I, that I part. That yeah. to, I think that goes to exactly what I thought all along. There's a lot of people that are trying to make it a story where Gronk was sick of the Patriot way and was tired of Belichick and didn't want to be there, so he retired because he would rather not play than play for Bill. That 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 is media people trying to write a story because sports have been slow for a long time, and they'll get a lot of clicks. There's a and, thousand percent zero choice chance of that. And he addressed that, that very question of did the, the whole Belichick way – and how tough it is to play for him and the grind really force you into retirement. And he said, no, he said the yeah, injury the part, the, the physical part of it uh, had gotten to the point where his body's breaking down and the grind of July through January of being able to take all the hits and, and do all the stuff had gotten to him. But now he's had a year plus to, to rest up from the NFL beating. But again, he's been learning how to be a professional wrestler and not get himself hurt. And, and look, you guys are into the wrestling, and I'm into the wrestling too. Those guys have to be athletic. They have to be trained and skilled, or else you are going to injure yourself or injure the other wrestler that's involved if you don't know what you're doing. So it's not as if he hasn't been doing anything for the last few months, learning how to be a professional wrestler. So all of this is interesting. I know he's had 12 surgeries by his own uh, admission here on his elbow, on his knee, on his back. Uh, so there's there's obviously some injury concern here too. Even even though he took the year off from the NFL pounding, are you uh, 